Let us continue playing. Let's bloody kill the Orions. When we last left off, I have decided that this entire attack plan is flawed. If I can put all these fleets into one attack, sure, I can beat the Orions. But I can't. So what I've been doing is I was reverse engineering their technology, working out what their limits are, and I have put up a new design. A lot of new designs actually. I've kept everything in the sixes that is either defensive based or isn't needed, but this is the ship which is going to carry us to victory. The Carrier Titan. Um, some X-ray laser warheads, 95 Graviton interceptors, some small point defense things, and yeah. It's a size bigger than the biggest ship they can possibly have, and we're going to build an entire fleet of these. In fact, we're going to build six entire fleets of these. I also have um, other Titan-class sh ships, which will go in those sorts of fleets. However, other things that can go in those fleets are the X-2s, which are my Dreadnought-sized... Well, in the case of True Transport, it's slightly less, but... Some Dreadnought-sized ships that other planets can build. Other things off-screen I have been looking at. Um, largely... Largely, we're now looking at the spying um, thing a little now. Um, we're going to start massively spying on everybody. And I mean everybody for their tech. We're going to go in, we're going to nab all their tech, and we're going to run away. That is that is the plan. In the meantime, continue, um, continue tech on everything that can possibly give us some weapon upgrades shortly. We need better beam weapons. In the meantime... What we're going to do is continue doing what we should have been doing for a while now, in that we're going to start crushing the various empires. So as soon as we get a free break, we are going to go and move into attack range of their fleets, for example here. Because we have a lot of spare troops built up now, I'd imagine. Are veterans experienced? Oh, we do have some experienced battleoids. And another one. Grand Transport, Experienced, go. And a third. This is the slight advantage of having lots of troops in reserve. We can now also deploy from here, thankfully. So one and two. And we all want the, that and that to go to Nubi. Right, in the meantime, up here, we can see that we have nothing to threaten us whatsoever. That is, that's not us. So yeah, we're just going to go and tap, nab the Ogda system. Um, might be worth trying to nab another one as well, but for the moment I think that'll be fine. Right, so, other things on the planetary point of view. We have most of our worlds that are reasonably sized building carrier titans. They also will build one every other turn. Hopefully, hopefully, we'll have enough by the time the Orions deal with all the attacking people. Although, to be fair... That could that could present other problems. I'm I'm really hoping we can defend on Fire Onus successfully. We have more than enough um, defenses on the way. I am going massively overboard with the um, defenses here. Carrier bases, carrier bases, carrier bases. As many as they will get away with. In fact, to try and speed your things up a lot, we're going to go and industry swap these. I did quite a lot of this as well off screen, so. We have a lot of things to be made now. You as well. Five, you're, you've got five. They're going to change to industry. We can import it. We have enough planets for it, certainly. All right. So hopefully their industry will accelerate. We'll be able to start massively pumping out defenses on that planet. Because if not, we've got to go slightly backwards, haven't we? That's a battle we're going to lose eventually. Also, which planet here should be... It's supposed to be you. Build a mobilization center. Dear God, we might actually need it soon. Also, some space bases is probably going to be needed very soon. Right, in turn. So we know Orion's going to happen. We're going to blockade it rather than attack it. We're going to intercept the fleet at Sucra. We're going to assault the planet at Okta. Insect, insect, and we're going to assault the planet at Nobi. Alright, various victories are happening. Now, blockading did have us do some damage to them. Ooh, we're they're, they're crumbling a little. 
All right, that's useful information for us now. It means they're not necessarily as doomed as I thought I might be if we're starting to wound them a bit. Attacking them might still be a bit beyond us, though. And hey, we didn't lose a lot there, considering. A draw, though, in the Novi system, they are considering. And up to one, victory. All right, new planet ours. So resulted in a draw, 32% casualties. Oak to two, one is now ours, which is awesome. Uh, we'll send in another Battleoids core then. Two. Two there. I think we're going to start doing now is cycling out some of our obsolete fleets. Yeah. Um, we're going to scrap this design and this design. We have more than enough trade transport sixes to cover that. We'll then get rid of... I'm going to be a little careful with these because some of these will quite be quite useful. Having 17 eagle ships means we've got potentially enough to that to happen. Also a lot in the delay box that's coming back shortly. Still though, they're down to four fleets. Carrier armadas and that. I'm debating an attack now, aren't I? That's what I'm doing. Maybe I'm not quite as doomed as I thought I might be. So that's four turns there to build um, that, 11 turns to build the other thing. And of course they are in the process of restructuring. Which they will do slowly. Planetary improvements in process, in progress. And lots of those to be remade. Yeah, we have lots and lots of spare stuff, don't we? Right, meantime, we're going to start attacking on other fronts now because, as I've said, no reason not to be doing this, really. That's two to go there. Uh, that's still being contested, so we'll let that slide. Um, that's going down there. That's fine. We'll be moving on to Century B shortly. Deploy Task Force. Right. What we could do with... against a long pack is some... Annoyingly, we could do with a carrier armada, couldn't we? Well, off you go. Carry it, and then we'll go indirect fire as well. No, that can stay there. It's fine. It doesn't appear as if we're going to need them on Orion anytime soon, at the very least, so... There is that. Now, 500 ships remain. I think we're just going to skip on another turn here. Just a quick check on everything else that's happening. So we've got some carrier 10s coming in, which um, will help out. You're building a carrier base. What are you building after that? Oh, my carrier titans. Yes, of course. And we have one capable of building behemoths. Technology point of view. We have eight and seven turns. Well, six and seven turns, rather. So our Antarian X is our result. We're going to again blockade the planet. We're going to assault, intercept, assault, intercept, intercept, assault. Now, if this goes a bit better for us, we might be approaching a sort of situation where we can consider actually attacking the planets again. I kind of getting there. That was a draw, but no casualties on our side, seemingly. So all they've got this is that's essentially a standoff territory now, because all they've got are the carrier fleets which aren't going to advance on us. Yeah, this could work. All right, air control, gain ground, gain ground. And the partial discovery there. Carrier Titans are being made. Begin the mass production. Uh, Battleoids there. Don't know quite why you're building Battleoids, but you can instead get onto Carrier Actually, you're not one of our high production areas, actually. Have space dock extension and build me some build me some scouts uh, carrier fives have been built then on frish we have things on opus that have been built but that's probably useful for them uh, let's go space dock extension and there just to start building some bigger things right so that didn't quite work out for us. We're going to have to deploy a new task. Not a new task force yet. But a couple more of these should hopefully 
tip mounts in our favour there. I'm going to have to start deploying another task force down here to go and take over that. We'll have a carrier armada, which doesn't include our carrier titan. You can head to there. Alright, you do have... You have a carrier armada already there, which is awesome. Let's have another couple of these. Head to there. And a couple of those to go there. Right, all that being done, and all that being done, let's just have a quick look at how we're doing on a few of the other things here. So that's now down to 5%, apparently, which is a bit lower than what I had it at, I think. But hey, if it's going to get us towards that beam weapon we need. Dear God, we want those phaser beams. I think I can just end the turn there then. Right, so blockading again. Intercept assault. Victory on two, three. They did seem to deploy some more troops though. The Brian strength is back up to 154. Oh, and I'm defending the planet Enobi, aren't I? Well, whatever they built died. And we lost 10. Uh, we're going to assault both planets. Oak to 2. Get control on both. That should be a new planet that is ours. Yep, Oak to 2 is now ours. Right. Build some more carrier titans. Fresh 4. That's fine. Uh, eagles. You're building troop ships now. Don't want those. Build some of those. Uh, what else can we build? What else can we build? Actually, why am I even looking at that menu? I should be looking at this one. Well, we can see that things are sort of now starting to swing our way a little. Um, right, Nobi now only has one. And Nobi now has two planets left, but we do have enough troop transports there for that turn, which is fine. It'll take you one turn to go and attack from there. I'm going to deploy a task force though. Which does not include those. We're going to need those. And Terran and Scouts. Right. So all of that can go and attack, I believe. We have 12 ships there in reserve. We have 120 here. Let's go and send in some ground transports in both directions then. Well, that direction for now, actually. Uh, now that that's ours, what I'm going to have to do is prepare to attack again. We're still fighting over things down here. All right. Don't think there's enough carrier for it, is there? Nope. All right. New task force. We're going to go indirect fire armada. Which should be enough, considering, to overhaul that short-range attack ship. We already have a carrier armada already in orbit. Everything looks okay. Meanwhile, we are now sort of getting to the territory where I might consider doing something about that. And also, I noticed that um, some this is now building more industry, which is awesome. Victory to there, shipyards, uh, they have correct troop ships, so that's fine. Planets, follow up this personnel. One turn, we get a new scientific spy. Hopefully, you'll be decent because we're going to send him on the attack soon. There was a bit of a delay on scientific approach, apparently, wasn't there? Alright, we're going to try and intercept the fleet here. That might not be the best of plans, but that's the one we're going for. Assaulting all planets. We can do some damage to that Orion fleet. And that might be able to tip the balance. We have so much on them in terms of production. Draw. We damaged them a little. We did come off slightly worse, though. I would watch the combats, but then they'd be boring and they take 10 minutes. AI control there, and AI control there. We lost on one of them. Oak to 2 is no longer in our control, and Lone Wolf is now available. Lone Wolf has 26 luck, but he's reasonably good at what he does. Go and attack the Orions for glory and moonbeams and cake. 
Not necessarily in that order. Um, let's see. Carrier Titan's been built fresh. Alia 1, wherever that is, we failed the invasion of. So I'm going to have to go for three Battleoid units this time. That can go to there. Oh, they have indirect fire units and carrier units there for the annoyance, don't they? Let's see how we're doing. We have five carrier titans built. Also, Octa 2 is no longer in our control, so I'm going to send some colonies over to there. Uh, Ryan will continue his next turn. Six things done. More carrier titans. Honestly, there's nearly a hundred fighters on each of them. That's, we're now getting to silly levels. But this is what the game has forced me to do. Silly levels of fighters is the is the future, apparently. Um, Deploy task force. Can I build a... A way for fighters which doesn't have all of those? Apparently I can. Right. You get to there. I should hopefully just tip the thing in slightly further in our favour. Right, in the meantime, there's no more people blocking us there. You know, an attack, Centuri. And just to make sure of things, you can go and attack Centuri as well. Um, we don't have any troop transports there apparently, so let's go send in three more. Oh, and now we have options. Now you're going to head towards us, but we could go and try and take on this place now, couldn't we? Deploy a long range attack armada. Short range. Nope. Alright, you're going to have to stay there. Darn. I want to attack, but it's fine. It's better that we hold off for now. We'll get there. Three turns until a scientific approach, which I'm hoping is really going to open. I think that is the one which causes us to have much more um, technologies available to us. If it's not, we could have some problems, but oh, look, there's under attack. No combat, though. Again, intercepting the fleet here. We'll take some damage, sure. I don't mind us taking damage, though. If we're chipping away at the new Orion fleet. It's worth it. Alright, AI control on all four. We got a victory in two games. And we're gonna be an open system. Scientific approach is now in the prototype phase. We have additional carrier titans are being built. And here as well, another carrier titan. Oh dear, this is going to be the mighty, mightiest fleet I've ever built, and it's going to die horribly in the first time I use it, isn't it? Oh dear. Apparently, though, you're building nothing useful at this stage, so let's go and build. Actually, I don't really need to build these. So really, they sort of replace the Blood and Berserk cruisers, but actually the X2s are good enough if I'm just using them as I plan to, as sort of backup units. Much better for the high production areas to continue working on. Can I get to two turns without losing money? Nope. Well, they're, not, they're probably not losing money, but that should be fine. Boy, ground transport. Nope, not ground transport. Task force. How close are we getting to our armada of carrier titans? We're getting reasonably close, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. So that's ten. That's enough that we can do it. It is enough that we can do it. All right. Let's send in some more. Should I can just put them there now? Apparently, because that's how much how developed that world is. All right. And one more. You. Two there. Colonies holding to Okta. We're going to then go auto build. Two more. In fact, just to, oop, just to guarantee things, I'm going to do a third in. 
Our production must be so much better than the, than the Orions at this stage. We just, they just um, cannot survive what we're dishing out eventually. We will grind them into dust eventually just by the fact that we have so much more production than they do. We have the better technology. They have... Actually, we should have info on Orion, shouldn't we? Forces. Other forces. See, they aim their own fire things down on units. And their carrier armadas are down on units. They're not quite as all-powerful as they were. I'm half debating... Oops. No, stay there. 500 ships left. I'm half debating going for it now. How are we doing? Um, insert it into new Orions. Let's hope you're reasonably successful here. And the Trino, no, none of those are actually any good. So I imagine they're continuing on from last time. Two turns to scientific approach. We do not see anything new approaching on the research topic front, which is slightly annoying. New turn. Intercept fleet, assault planet, intercept fleet, assault planet, assault planet, intercept fleet, assault planet. See, once that number, allied strength, matches what we got in the, z the area, then I can send more fleet in. That's my theory on it. 112. They're down to 83. Alright, next turn we're going to try and take on another, we're going to try and take another planet. AI control, AI control. This time we're actually going to try and conquer it. Partial discovery and Terran. Yep, scientific approach is in the prototype stage. The carrier Titan has been built. Uh, something ops. What are you doing at the moment? Actually, this is one of my reasonably high production places. Why are you building those? Said you should be building things like this. Things that are going to win us the war. Um... Missile X's have been built on the Zona. They don't have a lot of industry actually, so that's fine. Uh, Want to obsolete them now, but it's fine. We won't. Let's scrap that design because it's five. I think we do have an Terran. Oop. It's a friendly sixty-minute reminder because I spent quite a long time designing things beforehand. All right, so I've scrapped those few things. That should free up a few resources for us. In the meantime, let's have a look at what we're building here. Can we now build? No, that's indirect fire. We've got a carrier one here. So it reckons we need three more of those before we can build the proper full size one. Well, Almost like we nearly got enough. Um... We don't have any scouts, do we? Yeah, you should be building things that are useful to us here. Start building. Start building loads and loads of scouts. Alright, fair enough. Then don't build loads and loads of scouts. Build quite a few scouts. Quite a few scouts, quite a few scouts. Six, seven, eight, four. And you're building carrier bases. Once you're done with that, start building some scouts for us. So that's, that's probably the one thing we're going to miss in a bit, so... What are you doing, battleoids? Battleoids! No, don't build battleoids. Build useful things. Useful! Uh, a few more scout ships. Right. Just, so, just because we want everything to be the same sort of speed. Meanwhile, they have a colony detachment there. I think we can more or less ignore, and we're out of experienced troops there, aren't we? Oh, darn it. Right, two more to go to there. We want two more to be deployed here. Are we still not taking this place? Oh, I'm going to have to control that combat and make sure of things then, I think. And two. And any more that we want to do now? I don't think so. No, we'll just end that there. I'll actually control the combat this time and make sure it happens. Right. <sighs> Intercept fleet. We'll have one more intercept and then we'll send in... Oh, we wiped them. Oh, ho, ho, okay. Conquest time now. I might have killed Orion.
<sighs> well, that big fleet, as it turns out, was enough. Um, they have how many troops defending that silly little world now? Tsukiyomi 5. I'm going to have to check where that is and make sure it's important, but I don't think it is anymore. Land all troops. Uh, just going to go and killing some of their things off. Land all troops. And control combat. Land all troops. We have number them 6 to 1. Gain ground, gain ground, gain ground. Okay. Partial discovery. Have we now... It is complete and ready to be used. Increases population's research effects by 1, while overruns by 10 in all cases. So basically, our technology now is vastly accelerated. Planetary core heat pumps, which I suppose we're not that interested in. It doesn't give us more options, though, which is the only downer. But still, it's a bit more of a boost to our scientific um, abilities, which we're not going to complain at at all, are we? No. Right. What we then need to do... Looking at everything we have at Orion. We have lots and lots of transports already there, actually. We're going to assault it. I'm going to send in even more... Battleoids this time. We're not going to take any chances on the amount of ground forces they might or might not have. Orion. Next, deploy task force. Armada. Here we go. Falcon X's. And do we have any Scout X2s at all built? No. We do not. This is rather depressing, so we're going to have to wait on it, aren't we? Um, Alright, yours will take three turns to be done. Can you, no, you're actually in the process of building it, so no. Alright, well, let's just see how it goes, how it happens right now. We're going to assault the planet. Incept assault. Victory at Orion. Oh, I'm defending the planet at um, there, actually, but oh well. Alright, Orion 2. AI control, AI control, AI control. I think we just bombard and kill Century B, but... Defeat at Orion. That's not a fun noise, is it? Um, turn social structure is now ready to enter prototype phase. We have heat pumps, things. I think we have some Scout X2s at last. They don't have a lot there at all now. Um, right. Let's consider a few other things then. So we have a lot of troop transports. I'm going to send in some more now, I think. Because I'm feeling especially mean today. Good. Did, did, did. Right, and you're going straight into Orion. Next up, deploy task force. Armada carrier, we have two scout twos. And that's all we got. So we're still waiting. More, tra more troop transporty things seem like a good idea. We're going to send even more stuff into Orion, because why wouldn't we at this stage? I'm going to just make sure we have far too many troops on it now. Far too many. End turn. Assault planet. We're going to do assault the planet there. We're going to assault the planet there. Assault the planet there. Make sure I'm not selecting defend planet by accident. Intercept and assault. Victory in all fronts. Right. Control combat. We're going to bombard it. Unload all the weapons on it. And we'll land a quarter of the troops just because we can. See, that's the easy way of conquering Orions. We want, we want to do it probably somewhere. Strangely, though, I think we're still going to lose, aren't we? No, we were victorious. We have actually taken Orion. Bigfoot's now trained. 
and he's not that good at science technology steely type thing so I think we'll leave him alone there uh, we're one discovery away from getting another destiny another um, X available for research yeah look at that social structure is almost done see how things are looking elsewhere here beams up to level 54 beam required at level 61 actually strangely they have no more ships there we actually have a we have Orion now huzzah set migration it's ours we want it we earned it it's ours um, not particularly good actually has to be said well look at this is not terrible it's not the very rich, fertile Orion Free, or the rich substance there. Well, that's that's probably the best one we're going to encounter here, I think. Still, free to go. Free to go. More ground transports required. In fact, all the ground transports required here. So I want to beat one of these planets in ground combat. I was quite depressed at the end of the last video, but this one's this one's seemingly quite happy because I'm actually about to end this, aren't I? And if I'm not, well, yeah, I am. Orion cannot stand for long. It is ours. That should be enough troop transports, right? Oop, let me turn and find out. Right, assault planets. Continuing the assault on all planets because I'm really forgetting to send about um, troops to any other, which is fine. We don't need we don't need the other planets really. I might have to look there and see what they're actually throwing against us from time to time though, because that's getting a little um, on the silly side. Eight thousand troops. We're going to control this. I'm going to go bombard it once. Whoops. And then three quarters of the troops. Air control, air control, air control. And that was a defeat somewhere, which might have been on Orion, actually. No, nope, we conquered Orion 4. Lost the ship during um, expedition there. And I believe we do have a second on Terran X research now, don't we? Hurrah! Unrest by 7 in all regions, lowers heavy foot of government, and raises our potential oppressor meter. Which is awesome, but means very little to us, I think. So, Orion 2 and Orion 4 are now both ours. We have a lot of Antarans on that place now. Oh no. It's Orion 6. I, I misread that. In fact, that was Orion 5 I was clicking on. Whoops. Oh well. So, natural wells is a massively good thing to have. It increases everything. But not that we care about that. Two more planets left to go. Let's go and what did they deploy there actually? Short Armada. Pugh, not worth our time. This is our 524th army unit that we've now made. So celebrate. In fact, actually, let me just build a cord for the sake of it. No. Nope. Uh, celebrate for it is awesome. And I'm going to deploy a new task force. We're going to send in our ridiculous. Actually, you no. Know, I know what we can do. Just for gills and for absolute destruction. I'm going to go and have a look at what's here. I'm going to go create ground transports. Three of these should do. You can go that way. I wanted to even do that because I can actually hold them off from there, can't I? Oh well. Deploy an indirect fire armada just, to, just for finishing things off. Then deploy another inner fire carrier with its scout x2s lots and lots of carrier titans and that's going that way along with four more because we have we have to show off at least one of these surely so alia that's what's happening there meanwhile we're going to send in a couple more just to go and try and grab something you two to there I think this was the one that slightly worried us, but considering everything, we can just go long range attack. Deploy task force, short range attack. Deploy task force, reconnaissance. And 
I should do. M10. Right. Let us um, watch the ridiculousness of wherever our carry armada thing is. In comes the swarm. Oh, they're actually the missiles. Where's the swarm? Let's see, they have some recon detachments. There's the swarm. I think it's dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, we did that match the Antarans as well. They would have been fun. Except assault. Did we what? Oh hold on, they held off. What did they manage to do there? Two victories. Lost a ship trying to discover a destination, and I think Oh, we've had an Rex. Which one do we find this time? Um Yeah, actually won't tell us what it until we get there. And that's fine. Uh, they have put an indirect fire thing up there. We should have more than enough of those, to be honest. Right, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to have this carrier armada head all the way to Orion, which we'll get there in four turns. Just a sort of a victory march type thing, I think. i go and create some more ground transports. Can we go to experience again? Yes, I can. And one more. To Orion, enter. Assault planet. Assault planet, assault planet, assault planet. It's a fleet assault planet. And if you start holding me off again, I'm not going to be impressed. And they're holding me off for whatever reason. This is not good. What do they have there? Oh, they sent in a load of ridiculous carrier things, haven't they? That, that shouldn't really make it much of a difference. I mean, that's that's pretty much desperate last effort. So I know I know that one. Um, nope. Stay there. Send in a reconnaissance armada. Then go four. Let's go and find out where I've been building those carrier titans. Um, let's just go back to them and make sure they're still building a few of them because this might not actually be over yet after all. Even though it probably is, so I'm going to say until next time, and next time we're probably going to end this game. And if we're not, I'm probably going to have a bit of a breakdown. Until then.